Hey, good morning, Mr. and Mrs. Spring. This is Gary Etherington and Sarah RV located in Bernie, Texas, where we uh, have about four acres here of RVs and uh, 12 50 amp camping spots for our customers to get acclimated, 17 service bays, and four certified technicians. Today, I want to show you the Discovery 40G LXE, the bunkhouse model, 2018 with 18,101 miles. We'll go ahead and start here on the front. You can see this beautiful taupe color of the Discovery LXE, along with the frameless windows, outdoor entertainment. You've got your cargo doors here. You've got your tool mounts right here. And then of course your underneath cargo and a full slide tray uh, on the second cargo compartment here accessible from either side of the RV. You've also got a gas stub here for easy quick release plug and play for a barbecue or whatever you may need uh, to hook up to gas and also a electric bay here if you wanted to put a refrigerator freezer there. We'll go ahead and move around to the front. Of course like most RVs today this LXE has a three camera system so when you're driving, you can uh, signal left or right. You'll see down both sides of the blind spot. 2018, big windshield has no chips in it that we can uh, find. It's on a 380 horsepower Cummins diesel engine with a six-speed Allison transmission. And you can see uh, it's in very good shape. And if I can get Joe here to focus in, I know the tires are of some importance to you. We'll have Joe focus in on those tires. They are the original tires and there is one brand new one on the passenger rear. As we look down this big nice slide, all the toppers are intact, well done. And it's a high profile coach so you can see the rails up top. So uh, the air conditioners and Anything mounted on the roof is not really in view. It's a little bit more aerodynamic. Also, this um, LXC has Truma Hot, which is a lot like the uh, Aqua Hot uh, as far as instant hot water on demand. Just takes a little longer to heat, but it is a tankless water heater and uh, it's very popular in the industry. You can also see the uh, frameless windows on this side have uh, awning pull downs. These are manual awning pull downs that will come grasp here. Since there is no awning on the driver's side, you'll still be able to shade these windows, uh, being the rear of the bedroom and also into the main cabin. And Joe, if you could just show the one body little dent back here on this uh, cargo door. And then, of course, we've got our uh, chassis and house batteries located right here, and these will all be cleaned up. We haven't detailed the unit yet, but we'll, we will before pickup. And as we make our way to the back, 10,000 pounds towing capacity, 6-7 uh, plug for the flat towing, uh, roof ladder accessible, fiberglass roof, fiberglass front and back caps as well as uh, air quick release hookup for flat towing. Joe, why don't we take them inside this beautiful coach and show them the nice interior. Now that we've, uh, we've gotten inside the LXE, you can see this beautiful rich interior. Um, you've got the booth-like table here that also converts into a bed if you need to sleep extra, folks. Uh, we've got the spindle windows. Like I said, those are the frameless windows. What's nice about those is that they open straight up uh, and you'll get re reduction of dust and other things flowing into the coach. All the awnings around are day and night awnings. And then we've got this wonderful uh, brownish, taupeish porcelain floor along with a pull-out bed there, a couple cup holders behind, looking directly at the TV so there's no crane in the neck. And then we've also got a induction cooktop, a convection microwave oven, dishwasher, a coarse residential refrigerator. Let's not forget that this is also equipped with central vacuuming. So uh, if you've got your pets, which I know you do, you'll be able to hook up that central vacuum port and uh, 
pick up any dander that may end up on the floor. Moving back, and one of the reasons I know that uh, you're most interested in this unit is for the bunk bed feature back here where you can put your dog crates. You can see it does have TVs top and bottom. So unless you're gonna put the dog channel on for your pets, there'd be no need to uh, really use those and you can fold those up. And then also this top bunk will lift up, give you more room and access to do uh, what you need to do with your dog crates. You can see there's accessibility right to the restroom as we turn, all multiplex lighting and wiring for light dimming, whatnot. And you can see we've got a nice sink there, a nice round shower, plenty of room in there. And enough light with the skylight and the fantastic fan. Looking to the back bedroom. Making our way to the bedroom, you can see we've got a nice big king size bed. That beautiful cabinetry with uh, plenty of storage above the bed. And then working, you know, across to the back closet. You can see it's got a lit closet with some, uh, oh, it looks like uh, the, uh, what's that wood called? Cedar panels. C yeah, with the cedar panels, keep the moths away. And then looking straight at the Whirlpool stackable washer and dryer. And then again, you see these rich cabinets, a lot of drawers, some more cabinet space here, plenty of storage with room under the bed. <laughs> This unit has uh, three air conditioners. Uh, you've got two 15,000 BTU and one 13.5 BTU. Nice balance work, well polished, not really, uh, no, not any noticeable dings in the wood. And then of course, a generator start here in the back next to the bed. If you're in those campsites that have quiet times, uh, you can always set the auto gen start or just roll over and fire up that generator when you can use that. This also has an LG Smart TV in it. So you can uh, go ahead and use your fire stick or go ahead and internet up to uh, all your favorite networks and, and stations. As Joe makes his way to the restroom again, you can see the triple accessibility from the main cabin, the bunk area, and the bedroom. And all these doors will shut off to give you privacy and give you the feeling of one big bedroom with a bathroom in it. So this is a 40G LXE. We're gonna take one quick look at the cockpit. And as you can see, you have some nice big captains and passengers chairs back there. Uh, six way adjustable with heat in addition to your camera and your touchscreen radio that is Bluetooth enabled so you can hook your phone up to it. Uh, it also has navigation that can be purchased with subscription and then it shows off also a Freightliner smart wheel uh, which is real handy for driving. You set that cruise control real easy and then your signal tracking lights uh, on the right side of the column and then of course your digital checklist, uh, engine information located there as well as your dials for miles per hour and RPMs. Uh, it also hosts a two pedal uh, braking and accelerating system, making it easy to drive and of course a step well cover um, that will cover the uh, entry steps so your feet won't be dangling. And then a power uh, solar in the front and also a blackout screen as well as the coach has blackout all through it. So again, this is the XLE. If you have any questions, give us a call and we'll be happy to answer them. It's good talking to you, thanks.